JJ from SNS. I'm talking to you about our M8 plate and pump kits. Now, if you're familiar with our twin cam kits, some of these features are going to be recognizable to you. Okay, starting with the plate. The plate does have a brass bushing on the cam side and on the pinion side. Pinion shaft runout for this combination is 5,000 pinion shaft runout or under to be able to run our plate and pump. Now, the pump, I did take one just assembled up here for you so I can get inside and show you what makes ours different. I get the question a lot, why your pump versus somebody else's? The first thing I'll tell you is that it has three G rotors. Why three? What does the factory one have? Factory pumps and the other aftermarket pumps have two G rotors. The reason we run three has everything to do with the scavenging side of the pump. Okay, one G rotor to push the oil out to the engine, and we have two to get the engine oil back from the engine. Okay, your oil will pool in the crankcase or the cam chest. There's a port on the pump for each, and in a factory application or the other aftermarket applications, there's only one G rotor to pull from both holes. This has a G rotor independent for each cavity. Okay. These plates and pump combinations, you need to know whether you're an oil-cooled engine or a water-cooled engine. The volume of oil required to lubricate and cool that engine changes between the two. The surface on the pump here will indicate either an O or a W, so you can verify you have the correct pump for your application. For more details on these kits, get to our website, sscycle.com.